this is what I was waiting for. We have a pair of sunbirds nesting in our awning there and I ordered a trailer cam to actually stalk them while they are breeding and also hopefully um, be able to get some footage further on when we are traveling and we are set up somewhere in free camps and I'm um, trying to find out if we can get some footage during the night about the wildlife that is maybe running around under the caravan and um, whatever is out there I want to know and while I'm sleeping I hope this um, little thing will do a great job so let's unpack I'm excited yes you can say I'm a little bit addicted to all sorts of <laughs> camera gear and uh, taking footage and all that stuff so I don't know what the quality will be I have no idea what to expect but um, it wasn't overly expensive so I, th I just thought I would give it a try we'll see let's have fun That's the beauty. Digital wildlife camera TC06. I ordered it on the 1st of December and today we have the 9th of December so it took not even two weeks to come here to my place where we stay at the moment. Hunting camera manual All right so this is the camera quite large but um, I'll see how I can set that one up and also there are some fittings here to mount it somewhere permanently which I want and then the cable USB cable for transferring the pictures to the laptop and a strap to tie the camera around a tree or something like that which is cool let's have a look what kind of batteries we need there we go okay before you start i watched some videos so i know roughly how it works and we need eight batteries double uh, A eight double A batteries there you go so stay tuned that will be an exciting experience hopefully I'll just check if we have enough batteries otherwise I'll send Simon to get them but I think we still have some spares and also have to find out yeah here's the slot for the uh, SD card so we need a new SD card <laughs> all my SD cards are taken by my cameras so I need an SD card as well yeehaw that's the one from Amazon by the way I'll let you know about the um, quality you will find out on this channel Okay, I'm gonna have a barbecue. Okay. <laughs> 
And if you want to know about all the mess in the background, I'm just getting to uh, pack all the Christmas gifts for the children, for the grandchild and our kids. It's all piled up here. Simon bought some cartons to pack the gifts and um, yeah. There will be a few kilos less next week once everything is posted. And he also replaced our Noe or whatever you call this shiny thing there. Um, the TV and we got or he got this one from Officeworks for not even two hundred dollars. Um, because the other one that comes with the camera with the caravan is yeah quite poor quality you can say so this one goes it plays up all the time it doesn't work properly it's really annoying and um, we had a low point in the other caravan but we sold it with the caravan we didn't keep it I don't know why but uh, it was his decision so yeah I've got a new one and that's actually us for the weekend and the next few weeks until Christmas. It's nearly Christmas, another few weeks, two weeks, a little bit more than two weeks to go. And um, actually we are waiting for updates about the tropical cyclone Jasper, which is just um, building up in the coral sea and we are staying and watching which path he will go and if he makes landfall and all that stuff so we are a little bit on alert but we are in the Cairns hinterland we are not down on the coast so all the locals around here are quite relaxed and they don't think it will have a big impact um, so yeah hopefully we can stay and we don't have to move we will find out it is hot it is humid but it's not as bad as it was like two weeks ago, um, and even last week. It's a bit cooler today, and um, we have Saturday, and uh, landfall is expected for, I think, Tuesday or Wednesday next week. So, yeah, we watch and um, make decisions next week what we do. Uh, yeah. That's us, sitting, waiting, working. So I'll let you know what will be happening in the next um, uh, few days and weeks. I will keep recording. When you see this video, hmm. I pretty much think everything will be over and <laughs> we either have moved or we, just, we stayed. But. Um, that's our first summer here in the tropics and we are a little bit scared I can say but we stocked up with everything and um, cross the fingers it won't be too much and too bad for everyone who is affected anyway not just us of course okay see you in the next clip have a good one <laughs>